Hello everyone, welcome to the Ichimoku.co daily futures market review for the trading day ending Wednesday, April 27th. Firstly to bonds and the US 30 year bond futures and here we see a confirmed change of trend today, a candle with a higher high and a higher low, fairly large white body candle and the buyers have returned very solidly into this market and this follows the uh, very strong selling that we saw over the previous couple of weeks with a series of black body candles. The size of this white body candle is larger than the two previous candles con uh, combined and is suggesting that the buyers have found very very strong upside momentum. They've also closed with control so we're very very strong buying effort today and this follows the market finding support at the 160.31 level, an area where we've seen the market appreciate very significantly from. So there is an opportunity here for the buyers to go on with this move. Problem here being however that we are now trading back within the cloud and we may find resistance anywhere within the cloud extending up to the top of the cloud around this 163.04 level. We're also trading within this a highlighted zone of previous support or resistance and we may find some resistance at the top or within there. So an opportunity here for the sellers to return back into the market and test back down to 160.31. In terms of uh, the uh, price action being closing within back within the cloud we have a neutral market in the longer term time frame and that is supported by the chicka span trading within the uh, corresponding price action. It's failing to confirm the negativity that we're seeing in the medium and uh, fast term time frame with the Kuchin Sen and the Tengen Sen. But interestingly, that Kuchin Sen is now pointing flat. Price action is being attracted back towards that flat Kuchin Sen. So the market was looking a little overextended and is now attempting to find equilibrium and may continue to trend back up towards that uh, equilibrium as suggested by the Kuchin Sen, the pink line. Next to NYMEX Oil and uh, here we see a continuation of the trend to the upside today or a confirmed trend actually. The previous day's trading had to confirm that trend but it is confirmed now. Solid buying from the previous day's trading uh, suggested that there was very solid momentum. The market did need to breach through 44.78 and we have done that in a fairly bullish manner with the market closing up towards the high suggesting the buyers are close with control and they have shown some strong commitment. Uh, one thing to uh, worry about a little bit is the uh, reduction in the size of the white body. It's not uh, too small, uh, but uh, perhaps we are seeing a, a slight weakening of the uh, strength of the buyers in terms of momentum. But uh, certainly the strong bullish breakout above 44.78 does suggest that there is very good potential for the market to trade up to 46.72 in line with the market being bullish in all three timeframes and supported by the chicka span.